if elected, you would possibly be the first Hindu member of Congress from the state of Texas. Um, what does that mean for you? So it, it means a lot for me, especially because my father passed away 22 years ago. And I think he, he would be proud in particular because of representation. I mean, representation matters in a diverse society like ours. If you don't see anyone who looks like you, or if you don't think there's a possibility of your child growing up to be whatever they want to be in this country, then, then that impacts you. So the first of anything is something we should celebrate. The first woman, first African-American, first person of color, the, the first Hindu, the first Muslim, the first Jew of anything. and. To, to be honest, um, I will be the first Asian American ever elected to U.S. Congress from the entire state of Texas, which one of my colleagues, he's a state representative here, he said, that's actually not something to be proud of, that's something to be ashamed of. <laughs> it, it took until 2020 for us to do that. But part of that is that Asian Americans and Hindu Americans, Muslim Americans, we all need to participate fully in our democracy. We, we need to make sure that our, our kids and our communities know that it's, it's not just about showing up here, it's also about uh, taking advantage of, of those rights and those privileges that we have because in, in a democracy, if you don't exercise your rights, you, you may lose them. And, and we're seeing that in dramatic fashion this year, some of those rights under threat. Um, last year, uh, they tried to take 100,000 people off the voting rolls here yeah. in Texas. Um, and the reason was because they weren't citizens 20 years ago. Yeah. My cousin is the same age as me. She, she came here when she was two years old, but she wasn't a citizen 20 years ago. That doesn't mean that she's not allowed to vote today, even though she's a citizen. So like th those are the kind of things that, that we need to guard against. And the way we do that is by getting more engaged, by pulling more people in and celebrating those things. Every time we have a first, every time we break some kind of ceiling, that is something to be proud of as Americans, because that means we're getting closer to perfecting that democracy.